today's Food for Thought comes from the 5th chapter of Matthew's Gospel in the 19th verse which reads, Whoever therefore breaks one of the least of these commandments and teaches men so shall be called least in the kingdom of heaven. But whoever does and teaches them, he shall be called great in the kingdom of heaven. In this scripture, Jesus had just expressed to the disciples that he had not come to destroy the law, but to fulfill the law. He is the conclusion. He is the end point to the law given by God through Moses. You can't break any of the commandments and think that you will get away with it. As James put it, whoever keeps the law but stumbles in one point is guilty of all of the law. The only way one can truly keep the commandments of the Lord is by going to Jesus, who again is the fulfillment of those commandments. The law, because no one person can keep it, is a way to salvation. However, because Christ fulfilled the law, we can strive, we can gain salvation through our faith in him. Through our faith in the only begotten Son of God, we find forgiveness and we live under his care. We live under his grace. Through grace, scripture says, we are saved. By grace, you and I should live for each other as that is the way of the Lord and his law. By living according to the love of God, we show others the way in which they should go in order to find mercy and have salvation. When we live as Christ lived, the Lord, he has promised us a great reward in the kingdom of heaven. Many desire to be great in our world, but today I encourage all of you to live by faith in Christ so that you can be called great in the kingdom of heaven.